Well, here we are then in sunny North Wales. We've had a bit of mist this morning, but uh, we're getting ready for the start of the races here, the Sportsman Elite 600 and, of course, GP1. But I'd first of all like to speak to uh, one of the marshals here. Marshals, the volunteers, the unsung heroes of uh, Thundersport GB events. I've grabbed, uh, he's known as Papa Smurf in the paddock, but uh, Dave Jack. Dave, how long have you been marshalling? Uh, 1986 I started, which is 27 years. And what got you into it? I basically got asked to, um, it was a local charity thing, and my then wife wouldn't let me jump out of an aeroplane, but she did say I could go to Alton Park. And I went to Alton Park, and it just carried on from that. I think she wished I'd had jumped out of the aeroplane. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Thundersport GB, your connection with Thundersport, when did you first come uh, over to these parts? I Well, I first met Dave in previous clubs, uh, and then when my wife died in 2008, I basically took up with uh, Thundersports and GB and have done pretty well most meetings since then. Now, there's a nice family community within the paddock, and the marshals especially get along very, very well. And uh, the, the word volunteer is is the big point here, because all of you guys work incredibly hard. It's uh, Obviously, you've all got your own jobs to do uh, in between all that. So uh, you, you must enjoy it here because uh, you've been coming for so long. Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, now I'm on a three-day week. It gives me more time, and so I get most weekends in two to three days every weekend. Uh, in terms of the, vo the voluntary aspect of things, uh, you know, we've got all sorts of ages of uh, age groups that can come and marshal. Um, we can all, I mean, there's people in the paddock that even could come and marshal. So I think it was, it's 16-ish you can start? 16-ish, yeah, you'll be supervised and looked after. That's not a problem. Um, By you? <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, I have looked after a few that have gone on to become sectors and gone up in the fraternity. Yeah. And uh, what, the oldest marshal, I understand there's a marshal uh, 89, something like that? Yeah, that'd be Bob. He does Pembury and Brands Hatch. Uh, he's, he's a flag marshal at the moment uh, and he still does it. Sleeps in his car at Pembury. Yeah. And uh, you know, obviously, we're, we're, we'll, we'll call out to anybody. I mean, there's volunteers out there. If they want to come, they can just obviously get on the website. It's, it's quite an easy situation, isn't it? Yeah, you, you get on the website, contact the Chief Marshal, and he'll get you here. Once you come out onto the circuit, you'll unfortunately get placed with someone like me that's been doing it a bit. And I try not to get anybody get hurt or anything. And since I started 27 years ago, I've never actually had anybody injured on my post. And... You will be looked after and shown the ropes. Take it from there. Yeah, it's important to emphasise the fact that obviously with marshalling, there are different roles within marshalling. It's not like somebody's going to jump into to, to marshalling and then all of a sudden they're going to have to use the radio, they're going to have to wave flags. You've got corner commanders, flag marshals, foot soldiers. Yeah, you start, I like to start them off, um, say on the first half day, I'll just have them observing from the bank on the second half day. If they feel up to it, I'll take them out or they'll, they'll go on flags and learn how the flag works. It depends on their ability and what they feel they want to do. There's no compulsion that you've got to go out on track. There's no compulsion you've got to wave flags. It's what you feel confident doing or what you feel you would like to do, not what you have to do. We're volunteers. Well, there you go. You've heard it from the horse's mouth. I've actually spent a little bit of time marshalling uh, with Dave myself. I can tell you that everything he says is absolutely true, other than the bit of taking care of us. Uh, but no, I, I'm only joking. Dave is uh, a great marshal. Any of you that want to get out there, as he says, get in onto the website, get in touch with us, and get out there and get on the circuit. Oh. 
I'd go crawling down the avenue. 